Our hair is one of the things that we all are most concerned about. But unfortunately, it is that thing which we are least educated on. Whenever you run into a problem, all you do is you go to the salon or you go to the barber shop. Your hairdresser and your barber fixes it up and you are done with it. Nothing wrong with it except that it is not suitable for longer run. What you should do is fix it up from within with the nutrition that you get from your food. So it is very much important for you to stick to a diet that works wonder for your hair if you want to have a head full of great hair. Today we'll deal about 6 foods that are essential for your hair health and they are not only cheap but they are easily available. Well, a couple of them are on the expensive side of things but there are plenty of cheaper options available to plug and play around with. Numero uno is eggs. It is not only cheap and easily available but it contains all those essential stuff that is required for your hair or anything else for that matter. It contains all the essential proteins and vitamins like A, E, vitamins like B7 which is biotin and vitamins like B9 which is folate and minerals like zinc which is absolutely essential for the growth and health of your hair. Number two are nuts. Nuts like almond and walnut which is very much rich in vitamin E, antioxidant and omega-3 fatty acids which is top-notch essential for your hair. When it comes to price, they are slightly at a higher side of it. Instead, you can have peanuts that are also rich in antioxidants and biotin. You can also eat seeds like sunflower seeds, sesame seeds, flax, pumpkin and fenugreek. They also serve the same purpose as the nuts do. Number 3 are vegetables. Vegetables like sweet potatoes and carrots that are rich in vitamin A and dark leafy vegetables like spinach which is rich in vitamin A, B and E. So eat plenty of them. Number 4 whole grains. Stuff like whole wheat and brown rice. Brown rice can be a little bit expensive as compared to the refined white rice but if you can afford it you can have it a couple of times in a week. Whenever you buy flour make sure it comes from whole wheat. If possible check for the label in the packet. Number 5 is citrus fruits, for example lemon which is rich in vitamin C. Vitamin C also acts as antioxidant and it reduces oxidative stress on your hair. Also it helps in binding iron. Last but not the least are meats and fatty fishes like chicken, fish like pomfret, fish like rohu, katla or the Indian carp. They are not only rich in vitamin E but they are also rich in omega-3 fatty acids that is extremely important for your hair. And remember the omega-3 fatty acids from the meat and the fatty fish is much more effective than the omega-3 fatty acids received from the plant products like nuts, seeds and legumes. So let's discuss about the function of the nutrients and the vitamins that we talked about for the last couple of minutes. Mineral like zinc repairs your hair and promotes hair growth. Iron helps your red blood cells to carry more oxygen to your hair. Vitamin A helps your hair cell to grow and it also stimulates sebum gland to produce more sebum so that your scalp may remain moisturized. Lack of vitamin B7 which is also known as biotin can lead to hair damage and eventual hair loss. Antioxidants like vitamin E reduces oxidative stress in your hair and free radical and prevents hair follicle from breaking. Antioxidants like vitamin C does the same thing plus it binds iron plus it helps to create collagen that gives structure and growth to your hair. So which one of these were you implementing or are you planning to implement? Let me know down in the comment section. Also comment below if you think I missed anything. Now if you like the content of the video and if you think it is beneficial, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, click on the bell and notification icon and share it with your friends as much as possible. I'll see you in the next video.